Hello and welcome back to another episode of Fished in a Town to Remember Forever. Forever. And I hate to break to you guys, but you have lost an episode. So you're not going to know how I got this trailer. You're not going to know how I put together that car to scrap parts. It's very unfortunate. Um, I made a bit more money, but I spent it on those things basically. And we went and gathered some parts. That's all you missed, but what had happened is I was trying a new type of recording. And it didn't go so well. Um, it was so blurry that you couldn't see it. So hopefully you guys understand. I didn't do it on purpose or anything like that. And I'm very sorry that happened. But we'll just pick up where we left off. And we'll try to cover the things that you guys missed. Um, let's go. Um, let's first add all the parts we have for this guy, I guess. We can sort out these parts here. So I went and collected these parts. Ooh, stay on transmission. That's convenient. From around town. And, um, sports car. So we can use that as a filler. Because that's what those are for. And I was just getting back when I saved it and everything. And I realized that the video was pretty unwatchable. And I'm really, again, I apologize for that. But stuff happens. We will put sports car parts there like we did last time, I think. But we basically, we built a hatchback. Um, and we found that, yeah, we found that hatchback, we built it, and we sold the vehicle we currently had, which I can't remember what it was, but it wasn't running or anything, so it's not really a big deal. A uh, sports car ignition, I mean, we can throw it over here. We'll save it for cars we want to get going and not waste it. What is this? Sometimes when they're upside down, you just got to drop them like that, and you can see what they are. Passenger door, passenger door. We've got two passengers, so no more passengers. Band piece, sports car door. It's an extra we can use on other cars. Hatchback piece. Looks like that one hatchback piece is pretty damaged over there. We need to be careful with that. Let's see, sports car transmission. And we just need to kind of sort these out. Sorry about that. I think the SUV pieces are up here. Try and keep them everything separated. It's running, we're running out of room. Um, so there was a few errors spotted that you guys missed, but they've all been fixed thanks to Queen. Um, you might have seen in my last video. Um, I found an error or two, and I think they've been fixed. We're pretty sure anyways. The only way to find out is to really play for a while. And I don't want to keep testing because we keep on having things mess up on us when I t when I test I end up losing my game and having to start over and I'm trying to test some advanced features and I can't start over I've got to build up to them so I need to stay in the game and not lose my game sedan trunk very very nice that was convenient looks like it's a little bit damaged that away pull out this there we go make sure everything else is not damaged that was damaged, and that was damaged. Okay. Take off the rest of the rust on the vehicle, I guess. What kind of price we're looking at now? All right. 2.2. That's not too bad at all. It's actually pretty darn good. But let's keep sorting out these parts. Hatchback. And if you can hear that, just don't worry about that. It's just people saying hello to me somewhere or another. I think it's steam, but I can't tell. I can't memorize all the axle or all the noises. Front axle for a sedan, sweet. Also, I lost my wrench somewhere in the last one, so uh, or the one before or something. I couldn't find it anyways. Hatchback. Uh, hatchback and more ignitions that's always good sports car ignition those would be good ones for backups so I think that's all we got for the hatchback really um hate to sell it so early 
Let's go do some logging and then maybe we'll look around for some parts in this episode. But I need to tell you guys about the newest updates because I haven't really had a chance. I grab our trailer here though. There we go. I try to readjust a little bit. I'm a bit in a bad spot. There we go. I think that's better. Okay, what do we need to do again? I forget already. Um, oh, log in this boat. Look for some logs. There's a guy throwing some parts out. We haven't done much logging, and I wanted to test it out. Oh, I wanted to tell you guys about the updates. That's what it is. There's now some sort of farming system, but it's not exactly an open farming system. The way it works right now. Oof, what did I just hit? That was weird. Um, you have to buy planters and plant your things in planters. And then after you cook them, we'll keep looking for trees just in case they're in there. You can buy a canner and you can can them and sell them in your store now. So it's a bit of a tricky system. It might take you a little bit to kind of get used to the concept of it and everything else. But now it'll be an extra display you could buy for your store. Maybe we'll go swing by while we're looking for full trees here. It doesn't look like there's too many. There was when I logged out, but I guess they're all gone. I'm guessing they reset when you log out. I'll have to see what we can do about that. Ooh. Poopy. We'll go check out the new farm stand. I keep on forgetting the last video got cancelled so you guys didn't see any of the things I was showing you. <laughs> so as you can see, farm fresh over here. So I'm just going to pull over on the side of the road because I don't want to try to get my vehicle with the trailer in there. So here we go. I can't remember what this person's name is. You talk to them. So you can sell them things, you can sell them canned things if you don't have a store to sell canned items, or you could buy. And these are seeds, the seed of life, seed of life. This is a decorative plant, and this is a planter, okay? Planters take seeds. You plant the seeds in the, in the planters. You grow your vegetables, you cook them, you buy a canner. This one has its own stand, this canner goes on your counter. That's why it's a counter canner. This is just a canner. That's why it's a little more expensive. It has its own stand. So you would put your, you would cook your stuff and then you put it through this machine and it'll can it for you and just shoot out a can. Then you can take it to your gas station, buy a display for the cans and sell cans as well to make extra money for customers to make that a little more faster to gain cash and a little more exciting in general. So we're gonna be testing that out to make sure it works. We've already did brief tests and tried to make sure everything's good, but let us know if you have any issues or if you don't understand, we could try to include some kind of instructions or something, but let us know how it goes. I do not have a place yet, so we're not gonna take that for us yet. We do have a lot of chocolate mm. bars though. Mm waters. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Cans of soup. Alright. Oh, there's a vehicle hitting us. Okay, let's go look for those trees we were talking about. Now that I've explained that new feature, so that's the newest feature. I don't know how much we're going to keep doing, like we've added so many features to this game, there's so many things you can do and see and check out and including all the um, decor items we've added for you can really start to customize your house. I know there's a few more coming at least, but I don't know where this all ends. <laughs> I feel like we should be working on a new project by now, but uh, Queen just insists that we keep on adding to fish and that's happy. You guys can thank her for that. We'll get some more parts, I guess. I can't find any trees that are together. Last time I was here, I found a bunch of them. 
And yeah, tell us how you feel about the trees. Do you, would you like to see more trees? Would you like to see um, a tree area where there's kind of like endless trees or something? Uh, how do you feel about how much money you make off the trees? Do you like them? What, what do you think would be funner? Let us know what your comments are. Or we'll think about it. We definitely uh, will, but we, there's no guarantee we'll do it if it doesn't make sense to the game or something like that. But if it does, we'll definitely do it anyway, so if everything works out. See, I feel like the trees don't grow fast enough, maybe. Like, if you were going to be a logger as a profession, you really would be struggling to find enough work, basically. So, that's my opinion. You guys let me know what you think. Alright, so let's go look around a bit more for a few more parts. See if we can get some more parts on that sedan to get a better value. And if you notice my money's down a little bit, I bought this car for 1500 And then I had to rebuy the trailer. Oh. There's our paint. I knew it fell out somewhere, but I wasn't sure where. Round up some more parts. And I can't wait to see the desk that you can get for your house. Well, eventually we'll get that if we ever get enough money for the auto shop. You can order parts straight to your auto shop without leaving. And they come straight to your desk in a box you just open after. And you can order seats for all the vehicles that are newer and better. Basically, then it's the only way to get them. So remember that. You have to have that desk to get the new seats for the vehicles. Was that tree ready? Yeah. Maybe I'll do that and just leave it. And then if it grows back, <laughs> we can load up more at once when we don't have parts. It'd be a lot better for logging, or it might be a new way to do it as you kind of go around and let them fall down and don't collect them your parts and come back eventually and get all your logs when there's just a ton of them. One fellow was really unhappy about the log. He's like, oh, I can't believe it's a hundred dollars per tree and I was like oh, I thought that was good. <laughs> it's a lot more than most parts if you recycle them you get like seven bucks for that but if you put it on a car you get a couple hundred bucks like harder you work the more it's worth basically but uh I, mean, I think it's just some people who just don't have patience or anything that's just the way they are all right let's have a peek what's at the junk area while we're passing it looks like a van and another hatchback i already did large fishes recently so we won't stop there oh there's this oh it's a farm fresh sign never mind Kind of sliding everywhere at this trailer now. There's quite a few parts here. We need to get ourselves a store for we can be canning things and doing all that fun stuff and having customers and picking our own sign and maintaining the gas bar. I really want to do that stuff. <laughs> it's taken so long to get there. It seems like when I wasn't trying, I just like, I'd just fall into money all the time. But now that I really want to get there, it's like so hard. <laughs> but it's been a lot of fun. I love this game. I'm so glad we made it. And I hope you guys are enjoying it too, as much as I enjoy it. I never know if it's just me enjoying my own my own work so much, some kind of like weird ego thing, or if it's actually a really good game. So <laughs> I feel like it's a really good game, and I feel like it's it shaped itself really well. But obviously, you guys might disagree. Let me know though. If you want, if you want, if you want to, you can let me know. I'll stutter on that one for a while. I can tell how scared I am. T -t 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 tell me if you, if you want. 
of parts over here. Yeah, we're missing some. Yeah, quite a few too. That's the ticket too. Get a ton of parts. We'll get them all home and maybe we'll sell our trailer because it kind of freaking goes a bit nuts sometimes on us. And we don't really need it necessarily. If we're not, oh yeah, we're going to do logging and stuff. I guess we do need it. Never mind, we'll keep it. Got so many hatchback pieces. So I think we did all our rounds, basically. Check some tree spots on the way home, but we're barely moving at this point. Come on, baby. so many bumpers I absolutely know we do so let's just go ahead and recycle this one and again if you're waiting for the garbage job now would be a good time after you've waited around this long like you're starting to see it everywhere just take it and place it in like a certain area and then when you're you know moving through to get your garbage it's all ready for you that's what I would do anyways it's up to you obviously Too far away, I'd get a nummy chocolate bar. Nummy, nummy, nummy. And again, we've got so many bumpers, let's just get rid of that. I'll bring the truck around and get the rest of this stuff. And there's another garbage bag. If we're gonna talk to Cool Andy, we got three here, is it 10? Let's stack them up in case we do do it. That is, it is fast money, but you gotta just wait till there's enough garbage around town that you can do it, right? That's all. Do, do, do. Look at the rest of these parts before we get out of here. Looking like the hatchback we got the most parts for, but we got quite a few parts this time. And we already had quite a few at home, so we're pretty stacked for a while, I'd, I'd say. Probably forgetting some of the spawns, too. I know we all ch we changed them recently, so I get them all a little confused. To be honest. Alright. Let's cut it down and then we'll come back for the logs after maybe. This time we're going to try to find new ways to make money because we need money bad. So we're going to put this away and we're going to drag this out of the way for it doesn't stop another tree from growing. Maybe we can just nicely stack our logs here. We'll come back after we don't have so many parts on our trailer. collect all our logs but I think that's the way we do it I think those logs will stay there and save but I'm not sure so I guess we could test but I don't know if I want to and yeah if you do not agree with the price of the logs if you think they should be worth more tell us what you think they should be worth 200 150 this is going to be the hard part is trying to back into this trail. Just let traffic pass for a minute. I think we're hung up on some garbage. Yeah, we are. That's probably 
good enough. Oops. My eye was in the way. So many parts. It's like a junkyard. We're gonna have to get some of those big queen fishy shells there and be able to sort our parts out, put engines up there and axles or something to help sort the stuff out. So much of it. It's so busy now, eh? <laughs> so many parts. <laughs> we did good. We did good, though. That think about how many car parts well, that'll be. That'll be like half, like a few vehicles or something. Oh, there's some sedan seats. That'll be good. Oof. We can sort them out before we do anything else if, if it's everything's in a good spot. Van hitch. And paint. Let's paint this. Oops, there we go. Have to say hatchback so when you're pointing at it. There we go. Oh, looks good. any sedan parts we can on the sedan. We'll not put them away and use them if we can. Take it this is a driver's seat. Yeah. Put it over here then. Start a new sedan pile for next time. Hatchback. That one's pretty destroyed. Let's throw this one out. No more back doors for hatchbacks. I'd say we have enough. What is this? Hatchback hood. We can use this. Coop seat. Let's do our coop pile over here. Sedan trunk, which we do have already. So let's put that over with our other sedan stuff. Hatchback engine, which is good. Which kind of engine is that? Hatchback as well. Got two hatchback engines. So we could use one in here if we need to. A second hatchback hood. Maybe we will use one in here. There we go. Coop. I think we got three out of four seats there. I don't know which one's which. We'll sort it out after. Might have some doubles going on there. Oh. Sedan engine? Oops. 
I don't know how I made that mistake. There we go. Huh. It's like I can't get the icon to come up for some reason. I don't know. Maybe that attached it. We'll see if it falls out, I guess. Oh, that's probably why. <laughs> right. There we go. Whoa, Will kitten. You scared the heck me. out of me. Boy, oh boy, little kitten. Yeah, we got too many of these. I'm glad I didn't bring too many. Let's just recycle these. We don't need friggin' ten of them. That one can be recycled, too. Some parts just come up too much, I swear. Right. Fan seats. Hatchback hood. Oh, I got two of them. Let's recycle this one. Some extra cash, anyways. Let's see. Passenger side sedan. Back door. And we're getting there on that. Coop. 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 <laughs> Hatchback, but we'll recycle it because we got a ton of them. Sedan headlights. Oh, we have headlights, so we will. Those over there. Hatchback, rear end. Hatchback, rear end. <laughs> so many parts. Hatchback, front axle. Well, we'll be able to put a few of those together. Then, I'll have to check if we got the same seat over and over. Hatchback, driver's door. I think we actually need that. Wow, wow, we're finally done sorting out those parts. All right, um, oh, van, trailer hitch. Hey, wait, is that another van part? A van passenger door. Just repair it after you do that, because it does wreck it when you drop it from that high, but it's the only way to flip it, I think. There's a coupe dash. So I guess we'll go out on another log hunt. We'll start loading up our logs and we'll come back and see about selling that vehicle. And again, if you're having troubles with something, make sure you send us a message and we'll try to make a video. Or if it's an error, let us know in the Discord where we can get on it, try to, try to get it fixed for you right away. Don't be shy. Just let us know what's going on, what your problems are. Oof, oof. Crashy washy boys. Alright. That's probably good. Let's do this. Yeah, the trailer's designed for you could basically just kind of drop them in and it should just kind of sort itself out, hopefully. And it should just fit those. Yeah, that one's a little crooked, eh? Well, you get the idea. Alright, so let's go uh, head towards the lumber mill and see if we bump in any more. Again, if you want to see more trees, let us know where you'd like to see the trees. And, like... How bad of an issue is it? Do you need, do you think you need way more trees? Or just a little bit? Is the value off? All these things are important, but it's things that we should decide as a community together. Another tree there that I can cut down. Kinda looks like it is, but I'm not sure. Kinda forget the trees that we're supposed to get. I don't see any trees unless I'm blind, let me know. 
Am I blind? Am I blind? Is that one? That one's like different from anything else. Let's try it. Nah. I'm gonna say no. I don't recommend taking those shortcuts I just took. That was some tight stuff in there. Set a few axles. See how many our trailer can hold. Ooh, can hold for us. Before they start pouring out the top. Oh, it looks like it already is. Keep on loading. Somebody said that they thought the price wasn't good enough and there wasn't enough trees, but that was just one person. That's why I wanted to get some feedback to see if you guys are agreed. Alright, well, we carried them all anyway, so that's good news. load in with the other load but let's try it and see what happens what are you doing dude that was insane growing I guess it's not too bad better get our night light on here we been working on the lumberjacking jacking it all night long that's what lumberjacks do right they jack all night long jack and all the freaking tree trunks ah just wrote me a song all right we got the load we got the loaded boys. Do you see how many freaking logs are in here? It's like log again. Let's go sell these. We're loaded now. Cha -ching. Put our headlights on. Try not to run over the carts. Lots of garbage. We'll probably do the garbage thing too, but I feel like I'm gonna have to end the video. I get kind of carried away when we're playing fish and I just stop. I forget to stop playing and stuff. So and then I look and it's been like an hour and a half or 45 minutes. I'm like, uh-oh, nobody ain't gonna want to hear me for 45 minutes. All right, let's get some cash fast, baby. 45 bucks, yeah, I'll take that. 100, yeah, yeah, yeah. As you can see, if you do it right, I feel like it's an okay amount of money. Maybe they could be worth a little bit more, but it's a lot better than recycling, so. But everybody's going to agree and disagree on different things, and that's why there's so many activities you can do in Fishton. It's got to be there's something there for everybody, I hope. <laughs> We've all made almost 500 bucks, I guess, in a couple minutes. That's pretty good.
All right. Pretty cool. I was able to get them all without even leaving. Let's grab these parts before we go. I'm not going to grab that. Oh, God damn it. Why? I'm going to recycle this. I don't want this. I just don't want it. We'll go back and grab those other parts. And then we're going to do a little surprise at the end. We're going to sell everything and get the biggest profit we can. We're over 5k now. I kind of want to do the garbage job. And if we reset, it's all going to reset too. So. Yeah, there's quite a few all over the place. So. It wouldn't be that hard to do at this point. It's only 100 bucks. Maybe uh, that's one thing we could increase. Maybe it's, instead of 100 bucks, it's 500 bucks. Again, let me know what you guys think if you agree or disagree. Holy rusty. driveway for can work on automobiles for a while. Maybe we'll do some racing before we sell the car, but we'll sell the trailer anyways. I guess that's it. I thought there was more here. But it doesn't look like it. Alright, this should be on the back out of. pretty much together so let's sell it as well so 12k 
Oh, there's another car over here. So, this will be the car we jump in on next time. Let's not sell it. But let's tow it. Like that, yeah. And we'll make sure it's all fixed up and ready to go for us for the next one. This is a double. This is a good way to sort it out. Which ones go in? Oh. Back driver's seat. So this is another double. Let's get rid of it for now. Let's see. What other parts do we have for this coupe? Nice. Headlights. I moved off it while we were doing it. Oops, apparently I did it right. My bad. Do, do, do. And so when we get back, we'll decide if we want to keep this vehicle, if we want to sell it off. Um, doesn't need much to get it going, transmission, engine, and ignition, but we might look for something that we have a little more of, so let's see what happens, and hopefully we make some more money really, really fast, where we can finally get our gas station, which I feel like we're not too far away from now, isn't this, a, oh, it's a passenger door, we'll leave it back over here, get our hood on, Again, that's so much of our car now, anyways. I don't have a trunk for it, it looks like. And we'll decide if you guys want to use this vehicle to go racing or if we want to do another one. Let's grind everything down as well. Whoa, 2300. Maybe we'll go back. Sorry. sorry. Sorry to keep doing this. This is the last thing we do. I promise. I promise. I get addicted to playing, though, and I always try to make a video when I play, and too bad the last one got lost, but I did make a video of it. I just couldn't really present it to you guys. And it's the only time I play is when I'm on video, because I don't want to uh, just kind of nip out on the series and things be missing in between. All right. Uh, let's see, banking. Oh my God, we are so close. 22,000 left. That's the most progress I think we've made that fast, though. Really fast. Really good profit. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, and we'll be back next time. Bye.